Uh, I always make a point to greet the people at the door and I welcome them into my community. Uh, I, I usually give them a warm greeting and I ask them a little bit about you know, their personal lives, um, but just to connect and let them know that they're not just a number. This interview is brought to you by O'Neill Interactive. O'Neill Interactive designs and develops high performance, award-winning websites for home builders all across the United States. More leads, more sales, and smart, friendly support. O'NeillInteractive.com. Hey everybody, Quint Lears, newhomesales.com with Trey Montgomery, one of the presenters here at the Best Home Building Practices Summit. Dude, congratulations, awesome job presenting today. How did it feel to be up there? Thank you, thank you. Felt great to be out there uh, just to get to know a lot of the different practices um, in, in new home sales and just hearing all the different perspectives. It was pretty interesting to me. So you were asked to be a presenter because uh, you're an expert at new home sales and you've been doing some big things with Houston Homes. Um, Okay, tell me some things that you do different as a new home sales professional. Uh, knowing the product, knowing my product, knowing uh, just what I'm selling and doing the research and finding what the benefit is of, of the home that I'm selling. Okay, now um, you've done some big things, but how long have you been in, the, in new home sales? Uh, 12 years. 12 years. Oh, dude, that's big. What have been some of the highs, the lows? What have been, uh, tell me one of your best things that have happened and maybe one of the worst. Ah, some of the highs and the lows. Uh, I would say, well, definitely coming to Houston Homes has been literally, uh, honestly, my the, my high of my entire 12 years. Um, just having a builder that invests in the agents um, to me has been phenomenal. Uh, family oriented, just they, they really want us to do better, which in turn we want the company to do better. Um, and I would say the worst is just being with the builder that um, had the concept uh, that the homes sell itself. Um, and there was no type of education or training or anything uh, to be better. It was just, you know, you come to work, when they want to buy the house, they'll come to you, they'll ask you, where do I sign? And I think that was probably would be one of my lows. Yeah, I, I couldn't agree more that, you know, the... the I like to say when people say um, these homes sell themselves, I, always, I like to say like not after six they don't. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, exactly. That is true. Yeah. yeah. And I, and I'm talking about like okay, so in 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 new home sales, you're you're a frontline professional. You know, you we have to have thick skin. We have to have uh, you know a soft heart, but thick skin. Yes. How how do you stay motivated, still care and concerned for the customer, but 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 absorb you know the rejections, the cancellations. That's what I'm. You know, let's say if there's a, a frontline new home sales professional that's watching. How do you stay up? How do I stay up? Uh, just constant training and constant. We do a lot of role uh, reversal, uh, role rehearsal, um, and we just have the, in my opinion, one of the greatest mentors in the world, Richie Eubanks. Um, you know, we all, I think, uh, strive to be like him. Um, he is the consummate professional. Um, anything that he is requiring of us, he does it. We watch him do it, um, and we all just kind of are in his footsteps, in his shadow. And but one thing about him is. He is always willing to help us to get to where he is. I mean, he's never been any any other mentor that I've had in the real estate. But they kind of wanted to hold their position, so there's only so much information that they're going to tell you. I mean, he literally. I remember when I first came to Houston Homes, I was so in awe of him because the most homes I had ever sold in a year was about 25 homes. Now I'm over 100, but it was talking to him and him. He literally took me into one of the homes and said, this is what I do. This is how I sell as many homes. And I could have been his competition. This is before we were literally working together. Um, he, he just really cares about us. Uh, you know, he always tries to find out what our personal goals are, not just our professional goals. And then he tries to help us to accomplish those personal goals, which in turn, helps the company. Let's do uh, just a sales technique, sales prowess, something that you do, you try to do with each customer, something that would be helpful to the front lines. Uh, I always make a point to greet the people at the door and I welcome them into my community. I've never done that before. You know, it's kind of like, uh, can I help you? Is there anything I can do to help you? Uh, I, I usually give them a warm greeting and I ask them a little bit about, you know, their personal lives. Um, but just to connect and let them know that they're not just a number that walk through the door. I actually care about. So let's, let's actually do this. So I'm a customer. I come into your model and say, hey, look, Trey, 
I, I'm just looking. You're just looking. Yeah, yeah. So, like, no, g give me some, th like, in your greeting, do you say, do you stand up, do you walk forward, do you say, come, I mean, um, what would be a typical greeting, something that you would do to make them feel concerned, you know? Oh, I definitely would uh, welcome you to Houston Homes um, and the community that I sit in in that particular day. Um, and I ask, you know, how did you find out about us? You know, um, I ask what you know, what prompted you to come, whatever it is that you saw, if you saw us online, what was it about that that you saw that brought you here today? And, you know, just start to build a rapport with them. So none of that can I help you with more going a little bit never, deeper? I never do that. Um, give me a tip for presenting the home, something that you do maybe a little bit different or the community. Uh, definitely touch. People uh, love to touch things, so like if I'm walking through the home, I'm definitely, you know, placing my hand on certain things so they can feel the quality of the construction. I think that's huge, you know, grab that doorknob or those kind of things. Your countertops or, you know, the, the siding, anything like that, just in, especially if it's something that I know that we have above our competition. Uh, any resources, and you mentioned Re Richie, but any, anything else that's been helpful to you that you would recommend to a aspiring new home sales professional to get great uh, definitely just rehearsing when no one is there. It's just me in, in my model home by myself. I'm actually, and I, sometimes I record myself. Like on my phone, I'll record um, me going through the entire uh, presentation. Or sometimes someone can come in and I'll just hit record before. If I can see them coming in, I'll hit record on my phone. And then I'll just go through my whole presentation. Once they leave, I'll go back, I'll play it back, and I'll just kind of jot down things I could have done better. Trey, I love it. Now, quick question, Trey, does that mean you're number three? It is not. It's just short for Tramiel. A lot of people um, can't pronounce it correctly it's by reading it, so I just kind of shorten it. I think it's short for Tremendous. Dude, you've been awesome, uh, you. and you did a great job presenting. And uh, How did it feel to present? I mean, this is a, like a you know, high-level event. Uh, was this your first event speaking? First event speaking, not the first event. I've been here. No, I mean, but, but as a presenter, you know, getting up and talking, how did, were you nervous? Uh, not as much. Not as much as I thought I would have been. Yeah. yeah. You did great and continued success. Let's keep in touch. Thank you. We'll do, we'll do. Here with Trey Montgomery with uh, Houston Homes, yes, newhomesales.com. Make sure you subscribe to uh, learn from more professionals like Trey. We're going to be trying to bring you insights, ideas, and best practices from the best in the business here in Orlando, Florida.